Hi, welcome back or welcome to the channel. Now, I wanted to share with you guys how to become a Warframe creator or Warframe partner or part of the Warframe creator program. For those of you guys that don't know, Warframe is a game and I thought it would be a good idea to make this video because as some of you guys know, I do have another channel where I am actually a Warframe creator. So I want to kind of get, give you guys the ins and outs, especially these days since, you know, a lot of people are interested in starting a gaming channel. And technically, this is a partnership with a company, Digital Extremes to be exact. So let's go over it, okay? This is their official website. I'll leave a link in the description below to this exact page, but basically to be part of the program is different than how it used to be. You used to be able to just join via the website, but now it's a bit different since it's invite only. So here we're going to go over it all. Okay, so how to join. Um, how to join, first of all, is you want to use the hashtag TennoCreate on your platforms. You know, whether you make YouTube content, you know, Twitter, all that fancy stuff, it seems like they actually do keep in mind the hashtag TennoCreate. So that's something already to keep in mind. Very helpful. They say it's not mandatory, but I will be honest, between you and me, you probably should be using both hashtag TennoCreate as well as hashtag Warframe. Now tip two is um, to make sure you're using proper tools to categorize your content as Warframe content. What I mean by that is simply to make sure that like if you're making Twitch content, you make sure that it's in the right directory, the Warframe directory. And if you're making YouTube content, make sure it's in the Warframe directory. I'm actually purposely going to put this video under the Warframe directory. So yeah. And then the third way is the third thing, rather, is to publicly list your business email and Warframe in game name and platform you play on. So, like, um, I guess, for example, like in this video, if I were to put my business email and the platform I play on, like, you know, oh, hit my IGN and platform I play on. And, you know, like if I were on YouTube, like I am now, maybe I'd have a business email in the about section or even listed in the description if that's your jam onto which a lot of people like putting their business emails in the panel section. So all those things do help it because they have to know where to contact you if they're interested in your content. Now they do also have resources that will help you or rather can help you to you know create like more flashy things if you wish you know like these are resources that contain stuff like certain sounds or 
maybe in some cases certain images and whatnot. To the, the fan site kit and the content creator resource. Because technically, fan sites are one of the things that can be as a creator. If you have a site dedicated to Warframe in general, or if you're like an artist or Capture. Capture is a Warframe type thing. Think of it as making art in Warframe, kind of like those games that have that whole snapshot feature, you know, where you can pause it and take a picture in camera mode. Camera mode for Warframe, essentially. And now, finally, let's talk about what the Warframe Creator Program is exactly, as in what you get, what are the benefits of being a Warframe content creator. Okay, so the Creator Program is a flexible support system designed for Tenno who create consistent quality Warframe content and nurture a welcoming community. Let's see. So basically what they're saying in the sense that if you already create Warframe content, you might be a fit for this program. In which case, they will give you certain things, such as I want to scroll down here. So I can actually tell you some of the benefits on here, but I'll just tell you in general, okay? So, under here, basically, Warframe Creator Program, what they offer is content such as new in game items to review, you know, some showcases. Um, Warframe creators are able to give away platinum prizes to their community somewhat regularly and review items like the same day they come out so you don't have to buy them in game or grind it for them in game and whatnot. So it's actually it's actually a pretty good program. Now the Downside, I say downside, but, and that is if you're looking to get paid actual cash for, you know, it, no, they do not pay in actual cash. Now, with that said, depending on how well your content is received and whatnot, they have been known to sometimes reach out from time to time for a sponsorship deal of some kind. And usually if they do, they first look closer to home, which happened to be in the creative program. But with that said, a sponsorship is not guaranteed, nor is it mutually exclusive to being in the Warframe Creator Program. So definitely keep that in mind. And I guess that's basically it directly. I guess I will click on this one because I don't know how many of you guys heard it in the beginning, but they do not take applications at this time. I don't know if this is going to change in the future, but as of right now, making this video, they used to accept applications, but now they are invite only. So yeah, hopefully that answered all of your guys' questions. Like I said, I want to make this video because of the simple fact that I know a lot of you guys out there are potentially starting a new gaming channel and it might be 
good to know if Warframe is a potential avenue for a game you might want to pursue. So yeah, with that said, I am going to end the video here. I'll actually leave a um, card top right hand corner as well as the link in the description below to my Warframe YouTube channel if you do want to check it out. But with that said, I will catch you guys in the feature. Later. Mm -hmm.